Hey everybody, Wanna Weezum here. It is Wednesday, January 7th, 2015. Uh, again, 2015, we are in the new year. Uh, anyway, what I'm going to do here, it's something I've, I guess I've needed to do for uh, basically since Christmas. But i uh, got a couple things I have not unboxed just yet. I've kind of been busy. I did the live stream New Year's Eve. I've uh, been recording quite a bit here lately. been working on a... Uh, Pretty sweet new project with my nephew as well. But uh, what I want to do here, this is something that uh, my sister gave me for Christmas. Uh, it is a Skylanders 2015 wall calendar. Now, if you think, wait, that thing looks really familiar. That's because they really don't deviate that much in the artwork. Uh, this is the 2014 uh, Skylanders calendar. The same basic concept. Obviously, this Giants, you know, was the main game that had been out. Swap Force was coming. Uh, Etc. And so you kind of got like a mix of those and then here uh, There's really no element of trap team at all in that. It's kind of just swap force uh, at least um, I thought we'd do a comparison between the two kind of spice it up a little bit But so uh, something that I do like this could be good or bad obviously I don't know for sure just yet But uh, if you know it's a spiral January 2015 mega ram spiral I should say I really like that they made the actual page itself look uh, more special those actually look like portals uh, at least in my opinion they do uh, you've got the two month preview there previous and upcoming but uh, I like the aesthetic of that I just I don't know if you actually like write on your calendar uh, I'm not sure if that's going to take away the space but uh, nonetheless uh, looks like the featured characters are showcased there we'll actually kind of take a month by month here um, I have no idea what this thing costs there's no price tag uh, calendars are a weird deal, you know, it's like you can start buying them usually like September, October, uh, then most people don't really notice them until maybe, you know, November, December when they're thinking about Christmas or the New Year, especially like the specialty calendars like this. Um, sometimes if you like really want a calendar, in my experience in the past, calendars I've really wanted, I'm not able to find like after mid-January. Uh, that's part of the reason I decided I better go ahead and get this done. A lot of people don't know this thing exists. Uh, mainly, in part, a lot of people don't really think of calendars. Um, so you've got that dynamic working. Chase McCain is hidden. If you notice a few things missing from a pool table, doing a uh, pretty significant overhaul slash cleanup. More on that to come shortly. Uh, anyway, once again, there's our cover. It's the exact same size as last time. I'm not going to measure it. Um, actually, it should say. And it'll save me some time. Well, this one doesn't say that I can see, but this one did. The 2014. Things were so much better in the past. Uh, it looks like a 12 by 11, or if you use centimeters, 30.4 by 27.9. So, anyway, uh, we're going to go ahead and check this out. We should have like our end of uh, 2014, which we do. Uh, no surprise there. It's kind of like the group artwork, pretty much the same as the cover, but. Um, that looks really nice. Uh, 2014, you got the moon phases included. Uh, obviously, you can hang this, you can use it on a desk, pool table, you know, whatever you want to do. Um, I like to kind of go month by month, see who's where, what I would change. All right, so we've got Mega Ram Spyro, uh, just as we predicted here. Now, there's really not much space there. I mean, uh, if you're going to, like, chronicle your life, this is not the calendar for you. If you're going to put my birthday... Uh, you know, school's out, uh, you know, first soccer game, whatever it may be, this will actually work just fine. I suppose that's what most people do. Uh, so, Mega Ram Spyro, January 2015. Uh, February 2015, I don't agree with this. That's Blast Zone. He should have been in the summer. I don't know why people don't think of these things. I like the red killer, but I think pink would have been more appropriate. Uh, overwhelmingly, people still associate it with... Uh, Valentine's Day. March 2015 Wash Buckler. Uh, I really like the color of blue. It's just, it's March. It's St. Patrick's Day. It's green. We need, you know, Stealth Elf. Uh, something along those lines. But this would actually have been really cool with the villains. You know, just screw the Skylanders. Just give us 12 months of the villains. Uh, Wolfgang would have October, of course. You could have a lot of fun with that. But uh, it does look awesome. You've got, I don't know if you can see it back there. I think you can. The Water Element logo. So it's a very vibrant blue. Now, look what they do in April. Don't have a huge complaint here, but I kind of would have preferred like a purpley color. I'm very particular about these colors, if you haven't noticed. Uh, I do like it. I mean, it's a very, very 
very uh, nice calendar in terms of the aesthetics. Um, I just don't agree with the color schemes entirely. May 2015, you could go a lot of different directions. See, we've got uh, Full Blast Jet Vac. That's pretty sweet artwork if you're a Jet Vac fan. And again, you can kind of see there. Again, this is when most people get out of school, so you've got that going. Uh, the calendars are getting nuttier and nuttier with the holidays they include. Here's our reinforcements. Uh, cardboard. Those are actually handy sometimes. June 2015, that's not bad. Um, it's maybe not what I would have done, but hey, uh, you start to heat up. It's kind of the start of summer, so you've got like the bright uh, hyper beam prism break there. And this is really hard to get into the frame for you, but uh, I wouldn't mind seeing springtime trigger happy maybe tying with Easter, but this is trigger happy for July. Uh, Big bang trigger happy, I should say. Not a bad deal. Note the detail on that coin there. You actually see his face. Uh, the gears in the background, that's a nice touch. Uh, August 2015, we've got Anchors Away, Gilgrunt. Uh, this is where Blast Zone would have been nice. August, generally the hottest month for most of us. Um, September 2015, Super Gold Pop Fizz. Wouldn't have minded seeing, you know, something red, orange, yellow type thing, but hey, uh, not too bad. At least they got October. This is a month you wouldn't want, you know, a stealth elf or a wash buckler. This is Twin Blade Shop Shop for October 2015. And, uh, that coincides with my, uh, needs quite nicely. November 2015, uh, maybe we switch Stealth Elf and Trigger Happy, put Stealth Elf in the spring. Uh, I just, I don't know. Um, I don't agree, I don't know, I don't think of green and lively in November, but uh, nonetheless, cool artwork of Stealth Elf, and the green <laughs> looks really nice. And then in December, uh, Countdown is there, so... I don't know, Stealth Elf would have even made more sense in December because she's green. However, uh, they may have run with this like, hey, you know, let's do Countdown because it's a countdown to the new year. I don't know what the logic was, but uh, you kind of know what to expect. And again, I'm, I'm a pretty big Countdown fan. He's my little California raisin from the tech element. So uh, that's a nice touch. Kickoff Countdown would have also been cool like for spring, summer type thing. But uh, again, I do like the way that uh, all of this looks here on the calendar so uh, kind of the portal stage so that's your characters your featured characters you know the lay of the calendar so um that's basically it i mean those are your featured characters again i don't know what this thing cost sometimes when you get them early you know they're expensive i wouldn't think this would be but maybe like 12 to 14.99 ish in that range if it's much more than that that's pretty crazy uh sometimes if you wait and it's still available you can get the calendars really cheap like 8 9.99 something in there uh just for comparison's sake uh august you know that kind of made sense with the color but i want to showcase how much bigger uh, the days were it's kind of more a traditional look and so you could fit a lot more stuff on there if you write if it's purely for aesthetics or just simple things like you know Last day of school, vacation starts, my birthday, you know, mom's birthday, uh, Skylanders 5 comes out, um, online race with one of Wisdom and the Walkthrough King and Mario Kart, hey, that type of stuff you can fit just fine. Uh, but again, I sometimes like to document stuff on the calendars, I don't know. Uh, yeah, here we go. This date last year. Archean Crossbow Battle Pack, Sheepwreck Island Adventure Pack, Spy Rise. Apparently bought all of those on um, uh, Amazon this date a year ago. So now we know. But uh, again, this thing is available. It's pretty cool. And again, uh, if you just do it for aesthetics, it's very nice. I really like the portal. They went for something different. I think it's a nice uh, bottom end. And of course, the main thing, uh, if you're a big fan of any of these characters, you get a really nice... Uh, piece you can actually just kind of cut this out and frame it uh, hang it on your wall you can treat each one as an individual poster once january is done if you're a spiral fan you got that hanging on your wall and february is over you can have a blast zone artwork so uh you know you can do some cool stuff with it it's kind of a bummer i mean a lot of these characters were already used granted they're different poses but you know uh I don't know. I, I'm I'm pretty particular with that stuff. Bottom line, though, it's a pretty sweet calendar. It was a pretty cool gift, and uh, hopefully, if you got one, um, you'll enjoy it. If you didn't get one, you got a birthday coming up, or you're just like, hey, you know, uh, this calendar would help me be more organized, or whatever you can pass it off as, uh, go for it. And uh, maybe, like I said, if you can find it, you might even get a good deal on it. Since 
not many people buy calendars in July. You know, it's one of those things you either do it before the new year or right after the new year. And like I said, stock tends to just like plummet inexplicably and then prices go crazy. But if you catch it at that magical point, maybe like around now, uh, next week in that area, sometimes you can get a cool calendar and save some cash. So keep that in mind. I don't know where it came from. I don't know what it costs. I just know it was a gift from my sister. So uh, Chase McCain is hidden. If you see him, be sure to post up. Uh, you probably just need to look for his hair in this one there's not a whole lot of places he could be but uh, as always thanks so much for watching you can follow me on twitch follow me on twitter like me on facebook circle me on google plus whichever you prefer for myself and the skylanders 2015 wall calendar thanks for watching and we will catch you back here next time